night, Danger went to the hospital. And this morning, she came back exhausted. And it still seems like she's not right. You know what? This whole situation is really making me rethink how I feel about this girl. I mean, from the start, I knew she was a little bit different. Well, when you woke up in the morning, what you think? You just said, fuck it, I'm gonna get something on my motherfucking face. Yeah, that's exactly what I said. She had this crazy, sexy vibe, right? And I like that. I like Doesn't looking at you, right? you know? Yeah. Yeah? No, let me taste you. But over the last few weeks, you know, danger, danger slowly unraveled. It should She's be crazy. Boy right now. No, oh, I'm telling crazy. you that you should just keep your mouth shut. Oh, You're crazy. Me You're me crazy. crazy. I'm trying to be here. I'm trying to be. I'm no, you haven't been there. You've been here this much. You haven't been there. Where were you at earlier? Where were you at? Right there. I was right there. But you weren't right here. You were right there. I mean, at the lie detector test, she really showed a violent side of her that I had no idea about. Have you had thoughts about killing any of the girls in the house? Yes. Even my mama was worried about this. I don't think you would be safe with her. Six months from now, you'll be behind bars. I kept her for this long because the connection was undeniable. But now she's gone from crazy sexy to crazy scary. And I can't connect with that. So I know what I gotta do. What'd it do? I love Ray. I'm in love with Ray. At this point, my heart is completely invested in Ray, and I'm gonna do whatever it takes to make sure that we're together. Yeah, so I'm like, I'm concerned about you. It, it just seemed like every other minute, like, you're starting to bug out. Well, people have been lying to me, and they think like... I'm stupid, and I'm not stupid. And that's just not okay. Things like that aren't okay to me. Yeah, I know, but, you know, it's like, it's hard to survive. It's hard for everybody to survive, and it's hard for us to keep going if, if, if we got to worry about, you know what I'm saying, certain situations. I haven't hurt but I'm, anybody. But, I'm, but I know, but I'm concerned yeah. about that. I'm concerned about you hurting yourself. Why would or I somebody hurt myself? or somebody getting hurt. Why would I hurt myself? Because you could be put up in a situation where you feel like you might have to defend yourself. I like you so much that I'm not gonna do anything like that. Like it just seemed like this shit is too much for you out here right now. This is just a lot, you know, but it's not like I can't handle it. That's really what happened. You so, alright, Ma? No, because I had to go to the hospital because I just thought I was really sick and I was scared. <laughs> And then now everybody is just thinking all this shit about me and saying that I'm crazy and I'm not crazy. I'm very sane. I'm just intelligent and different. Like, and it's bugging me out. I don't want you to get on here and, and really get sick or, you know, want to hurt yourself. Mentally and emotionally, I just don't feel like you need to go through any more of this shit. Do you want me to leave? Even though I feel like we're connected, I want you to leave. I want you to leave because I'm concerned about your safety. When I'm telling Danger that she has to go home, I'm feeling a little sad. I felt the connection with her. I felt like she was smart and artistic. I feel all of that. But bottom line is, Danger's unstable. And no matter how good we connected or how we vibed, you know, baby girl gotta go home. You know what? I don't even wanna talk anymore. I'm just gonna get my stuff and go. I know me and Ray are still gonna see each other after I leave. Ray and I love each other. Whoever he picks at the end of his thing, he's gonna still be with me. Hi. Are you? Hey, really? Yeah. So look, I just want to holler at y'all for a minute, real quick. Um, I just had a talk with Danger, right? And I just want y'all to know, you know, I do like crazy girls. You know, I like it when it's crazy and it's sexy. You know, I don't like it when it's crazy and scary. I was too worried about her health, her safety issues, y'all safety issues, my safety issues. So I, I just sent her home. Are you serious? I just sent her home. You're playing, right? He's gonna be like, I'm going in, I'm going in. 
Huh? April Fool? Nah, it's no joke. I just sent her home. Are you serious? I had to. Dang, is going home. That bitch is finally getting the fuck out of here. It's about fucking time. Me and Cocktail were hella worried about you. I was like, he is crazy. He got his head on straight this morning and he kicked it to the curb. No more sleeping with the one eye open. <laughs> it was something that had to happen. But I still want to hop on the jet. Yeah. I still want to go to y'all hometowns. Yay. I want to meet y'all parents. Like, I'm real excited about that. This is it. I'm down to my final two girls. I'm going to fuel up the jet, and we're going to take a trip. We're going to go to your hometown together. Then I'll meet you in your hometown. Okay. They met my family. I got to meet their family. It's only right, you know? And then me and you, we'll meet up with you in Vegas. What? Shut up! So Ray tells us that we're going to Las Vegas for final illumination and I'm super excited about going and just fucking rocking out and making this like the most unforgettable trip he's ever had. So I'm still excited. Oh my God. I wanted to go to Vegas because I got a big decision to make and I want to do it in a town where big things happen. Big buildings, big money, big success and overall more than anything, big love. Let the fireworks happen. Hey, okay with me. All right. I was like, tell you. I was like, oh, oh, baby. Okay, tell so get on my man out here. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. So y'all get y'all stuff packed. I'm hitting y'all hometowns. Just be ah! ready. All right? I'm dreaming. Pinch me. Go <laughs> ahead. Are you lying? <laughs> Y'all just gonna think I'm just a crazy bitch, huh? You are crazy. Cut the cord. I'm free. I was sad because I'm gonna miss him, but it's not like I'm not gonna see him anymore. Overall, I can't wait to get the fuck out of here. 